So welcome back to video two. Uh, if you're not a subscriber, make sure you do. This is a great community. I love the finish. Wait. Da, 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 da. And then the intro has, uh, this is an octave lower though, I can't do it high. It's like a da. Uh, something like that and the uh, the the sort of the monster epic riff in this song which is really cool it sounds so great it's like oh. That is so epic. I love that big monster riff. Part in around four minute mark. Is Which is a very, actually that's a very uh, Spanish guitar feeling, you know. So I was very interested to read that the singer in this band collects vinyl and he's always checking out vinyl stores probably when he's on tour or all the different places he goes and that's kind of exciting. I mean I mean I'm just getting into vinyl right now too and and perhaps maybe that's why he's discovered a lot of the old progressive rock stuff like I am like there's stuff like Star Castle here. I never even heard of them. And they're really cool and they're progressive and uh, there's lots of Mike Oldfield and God, this that that's just barely scratching the surface. I wanted to ask you, Florida Bell, what is it you like about the quality of singing that this guy is Mike or Mike Okerfeld, Ackerfeld, right? This is Mike, Michael. Sorry, it's at the top of my head. And his voice is very beefy to me. It's very um, you can just hear the bristling of his mustache <laughs> he's got a very 70s to me it's a very 70s sounding voice if there is such a thing anyway spiraling up talk to you all later bye mm -hmm.